All right, y'all ready for your headlining comedian tonight? I guess she's the, she's the headliner because she's the last lady standing, and I love this person. She came into this class with a ton of enthusiasm, ready to rock and roll, um, and just blew me away with her writing, her performing, and just how she evolved over the course of this curriculum. I love her. You guys are going to love her. Can we crank it up to like a 12 and a half for my good friend, Miss Sarah Shapiro, everybody? <laughs> never had a boyfriend. I'm straight. I just can't prove it. I wish there was a dating site like Carvana. They deliver the guy right to your door. We'll call it e Carmony. I'd get a try him out for 30 days. If he doesn't work, I can return him. No questions asked. Sorry, e Carmony. This guy moves way too fast, is terrible with gas, leaking fluids, and addicted to speed. <laughs> Guys lie to you online just like car dealers. I meet you in person, you definitely have more miles than in your profile. Man, you are damaged. How many owners did you have? This is the junkyard. I wanted the hunk yard. <laughs> it's tough because I'm looking for someone like my dad. Funny and successful. The problem is there aren't many guys my age with gray hair, a gut, and married to my mom. <laughs> My relationships are picking up. In fact, I just moved in with a guy. He's 53. I love it. His wife does not. I told her, you brought this on yourself, mom. Speaking of relationships, I just got into an exotic new relationship. She's from the Amazon. Her name's Alexa. At first, I was nice and respectful. Alexa, can you please skip this song? As the months went on, I became borderline psychotic. Alexa, skip the freaking song. Why don't you ever listen to me? You're like my mom. Only better, because you stayed in my life. And I know your name. Love you, Mom. <laughs> People expect me to be with my mom all the time because I look so young. But I'm more grown up than you think. In fact, a cute guy brought me here tonight. <laughs> He's my babysitter. <laughs> People discriminate against me for looking young. The other day, I was on a flight. The flight attendant asked, where's your mom? I was like, oh, because I look young? She's like, no, because she needs to change your diaper. And your ticket says lap child. You have to be 15 to sit in the exit row. Without asking my age, they told me I couldn't sit there. I told them I'd move on one condition. I want a coloring book. When I go to bars, everyone looks at me like I'm a kid. It's like they've never seen an adult wearing a onesie. <laughs> Saturday night, I ordered a vodka tonic. The bartender gave it to me in a sippy cup. I should have expected it. I was sitting in a booster seat, waiting for a cute guy to pick me up. <laughs> and burp me. <laughs> Speaking of cute guys, when you take on the role of a boyfriend, you are committing to being a detective. You must notice every little detail. For instance, 
If she gets a haircut and you don't notice, you're getting cut. <laughs> well, say one thing and mean another. That's why I'm writing a book called Men Are From Mars, Women Are From Venus. You think you're the man because you have a big ego. Here's a sneak peek. When a woman's pissed, she won't tell you. But you'll know something's off. Kind of like when you drink milk and there's a chew to it. When a woman says, I'm sad, what she means is she wants ice cream, a foot rub, and for you to be Brad Pitt. You know, all realistic things. Ah, get between the toes, Brad. I have cramps. <sighs> Means I'm not leaving the house. If the cramps last for more than 48 hours, pay attention, dude. She's in labor. Probably not with your kid or anything, but help a girl out. When a woman says, I'll be out in a minute, it's true, you just won't know which one. <laughs> Regardless if you're a man or a woman, cops can be intimidating. Every time I see a cop, I'm scared I'm gonna get arrested. Which is dumb because I never do anything wrong. Except for this one time in kindergarten. I showed up without pants on. Would have been fine. If I had on underwear. The problem is, I was the teacher. It's tough to find a boyfriend when you're on America's Most Wanted. Thanks so much, have a great night. Number Sarah Shapiro.